Day of Thieves 2024 preview event live commentated by your Curse Capitano Hippo TC. Here we are. Things are about to get crazy and fun and crazy. If you're nervous, don't be too nervous, okay? Everything will be fine, probably. Probably. Oh, I'm a little nervous, actually. What is it gonna bring, chat? Never got your popcorn? The energy level is good. The ads are finishing, don't worry. Are they gonna fix the crashes? I don't know, I hope so. Season 20 is Space and Dragons. Hunters call Emissary and Voyages would be awesome. It would be so good. Play the video, it's time. Play it. Let's go. Your energy level is still at maximum hit a bit. Welcome yeah. to the Sea of Thieves 2024 preview event, where we're going to give you your first look I love at you, some Don. of the exciting features coming to Sea of Thieves this year. We are going to share information around what's coming in seasons 12 and 13, as well as even further into the future, with a sneak peek behind the curtain on season 14. So grab a grog and get ready for adventure, as we reveal some of the incredible bounty of features headed what to was Sea that? of Thieves in 2024. What? What was that? Sweet Nectar, the way of Lords. This is everything Season I've ever 12, wanted. 13 and 14 are fully exploring that. Oh giving my you new gosh. options, new tools, and fundamentally new possibilities I'm standing on a that chair. make this game unique and special. I think when you this look at crazy. the year ahead, see if these are plans for Season 12, Season 13, and Season 14. It's kind of I making the shift weird away on my from chair. these big kind of systemic changes to Sea of Thieves and returning back to the core of what makes Sea of Thieves so special. I love the heart it. of Sea of Thieves, about giving players new tools to create new stories out there in the world. I We're ultimately love it. shaking up the meta, yeah, giving players new meta. tools to learn and master. And I can't wait to see what combinations players start settling on before we shake it back up again. Oh While everything that you're seeing today goodness. is still work in progress and possibly subject to change in some ways, we will be giving more insights onto how these things are developing as we come closer to launch for each of them. With the richness of all these new seasons and of course, PlayStation Pirates joining us as well, it is such an exciting year for Sea of Thieves in 2024. Thank you for joining us for the Sea of Thieves wow. 2024 preview event. Wow, we hope wow, you've enjoyed wow. this sneak peek of oh what's coming throughout goodness. the rest of the year. There's still a lot more to reveal for these seasons, so keep an eye on the horizon as we'll have more to share closer to each season's launch. For more information and to keep up to date with what's new in Sea of Thieves, check out our social channels. So until our paths cross again, happy sailing, and we'll see you on the sea. <laughs> oh, we're getting owls too. Okay, cool. Welcome to the Sea of Thieves 2024 preview event, where we're going to give you your first look. Oh, my sweet nectar of the whale lord. Ladies and gentlemen, that is the biggest news to Sea of Thieves I think I've ever seen ever in the history of ever. Okay, I don't even know where to begin. I don't even know where to begin. Season 12 looks great. The weapons look awesome. I'm in. Very excited. The world is changing. We got some really ridiculous new meme-tastic weapons. It's going to be amazing. Season 13, we get some crazy player-activated event that's like a, like a moving player event. It's awesome. Oh, my goodness. Season 14 is amazing. Sounds so fun. I love the... I feel like they need to make it so that you can have, like, another weapon, though. I I don't know. I feel like I, if I want the blow dart, like, I want to blow something and, like, hit you and, like, it mess... mess I don't want to give up my sword or my flintlock for that. I don't even know what to say. That's crazy. 
I feel like we need a third slot, but maybe the third slot is dedicated to like these new, like maybe not a weapon per se, but like one of the new tools, I guess. I don't know. That is crazy. I don't even know what to begin to say. That is insane. That's crazy. It's the craziest thing, chat. It's the craziest news. Genuinely. Uh, there's nothing that I saw in that that I'm like, oh, I didn't. I wish that didn't exist. That's amazing. That's incredible. If game changer year, that's that's a hundred percent real. That truth. We got throwing knives. I don't know about the double barrel flintlock. To be honest, looks kind of weird, but we'll see. You know, it might be awesome. Deck shots. Every fight, no tanks. The the the. The things, chat. Imagine boarding a boat and then just chucking one of those, like, the the skeleton bombs down on the boat. It's like, hey, I'm here, but bam, and you just chuck it down. There's skeletons everywhere. We're gonna get traps, which is gonna be cool. The only thing I'm concerned about is the damn horn and Briggs, because they're too fast already. <laughs> You're never going to be able to get away. I It looks amazing. Skelly grenade is a Tucker finder. Oh, interesting. Yeah, it would. It would, it would, it would. Harpoon boarding. I don't even know what to begin to say. I, I think it all looks incredible. I really do. If the game runs smoothly... It's going gonna, it's gonna to be the biggest year of Sea of Thieves, hands down, straight up. No, like, there's no ifs, ands, or buts about it. The biggest year for Sea of Thieves. PlayStation 5 launch, seasons 12, 13, and 14 look incredible. Everything that we watch is an improvement to the sandbox, which is what I love. I think they're encouraging mischief. Good. All I saw was a bunch of stuff that's going to make Hippo in more trouble. <laughs> so maybe. They're dedicating a team to working on the fixes. That makes me so happy. That's incredible. What a huge W. I don't even know what to say. I am just like, my mind is blown. Rare, this goes out to you guys. I'm going to talk to, if you guys watch this video, Andrew or Mike or any of you guys, I just want to say thank you. Thank you for me. A longtime player of this game. I love this game so much. And the fact that you guys are focused on the sandbox, bringing more tools and not rules, and just allowing us to experiment and have fun and play this amazing sandbox game that you have created. I just want to speak for me and maybe all the people over here on the chat. They're going to say some words to you as well. Uh, thank you. Because, listen, I know sometimes things don't work. And I know sometimes, you know, you guys often don't see the praise that you guys deserve. 12, 13, and 14 might be the best seasons to date. And the game is going to fundamentally change. I can't wait to see it. I'm so glad that we're shaking up the meta for this game. I'm just excited to see where we go. Huge shot to you guys. Everyone on the dev team. Drew, to you as well. Shelly, you guys are legends. Legends, legends, legends. Thank you. Thank you for just being absolute studs. Don't even know what to say. Golly. My mind is blown. I think season 14 might be my favorite, though. We're going to be able to crouch, maybe, sneak around, hang on the side of the boat. Are you kidding me? You ma Can you imagine for a moment how ridiculous it's going to get? Oh, my goodness. The flame heart stuff looks awesome. And owls, chat. Owls. I don't really care about owls, but owls. Hide inside of a chest. My mind is my mind is blown. Don't even know what to say. Shocked. 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 Huge. Insane. Craziness. I don't like if there's one thing I don't like. It's that the stupid harpoon thing requires you to use the eye breach. Can I can I use my flintlock with that? 
Can, can that be like maybe a shorter distance or something? That's the only thing I don't like. Because I don't want to use the I've reached. I want to use the phone lock. That's kind of sucky. It's the only thing. I think it's a separate weapon. It's an uh, well, maybe. Who knows? The the uh the sh the the horn thing, there's so much potential of that, it's actually insane. Okay. Like it's just just, <laughs> there's just so much potential for that it's it's literally hard to explain i can't even begin to imagine the chaos that we will unfold <laughs> thanks for the chance of legends and you're just like, meow, out of there with the rowboat i was dying laughing from that that that's so hilarious i'm in to slow enemy ships down <laughs> I think it's a different weapon. They don't have a model for it yet since it's season fortune release. So the eye of reach model. Gotcha. Hopefully that would be cool. I would love to get another slot like a slot to be able to use the harpoon or to use the blow dart, you know? Wow. My mind is blown. Truly. Truly, 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 truly. There's nothing better for Sea of Thieves than improvements upon the sandbox. That makes sense? There's nothing better for Sea of Thieves than improvements to the sandbox. The sandbox is what we love about this game. The silly shenanigans is what we love. There's nothing about this game that makes it better than when the sandbox gets improved. Third. I Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Firefox or, or Mr. Fox. As a solo, I think I will be done with this game. I don't know. I don't think so. I don't think so. If we see some ship improvements, like, I don't think so. Chest tuck will be great. Yeah, they did great. You, but everything within this, you know what makes these so great? I'm going to say this. I'm going to step up, use a restroom, um, grab a little snacker doodle, and we're going to jump back in the game. I'm going to say this. Everything about this update, these three next three seasons, seasons 12, 13, and 14, the reason they're going to be so incredible is because they're focused on the sandbox. They're focused on the sandbox, and they're focused on the lore for the game. This game is incredible. The lore of this game is incredible. Mm. Big.